All right, guys. So we just had those matches, uh, and it was a the championship match, the ABYW championship match between Aaron and Austin, better known as Gribby and B Step. They had a match, and I'm gonna go talk to uh, Gribby about how it felt to actually win, and if he figured he would, and all about that. So here it goes. If he ever answers the door. What's up, man? What's up, dude? What's going on? Nothing. Uh, well, I decided because you just had that special night tonight, you know, you had that ABYW championship match tonight with uh, B-Step. We're Austin, what do you want to know? Call him. Uh, I was just wondering how it felt to win. Well, man, it feels pretty good, you know. Um, I had a successful title defense. Um... As you guys seen on the video, but um, I mean, I feel pretty good. You know, Austin is a tough component. Um, during the match, I was th I was beginning to wonder. I was like, what do I have to do to beat this guy? Like, I'm better than him. I know I am. Like, what do I have to do to beat him? So I mean, we kept going on with the match, and I started getting more sore. I started getting more uh, out of energy, and then whenever he threw me on that doghouse, like, it kind of hurt a little bit, and I thought he had me, I, like, I thought he was going to do his finisher or something, but we ended up getting over there, and I just put his head on that thing, and I see my opportunity, and I went for it, and did my finisher, and I pinned him, I mean, it hurt a little bit, I mean, yeah, but here I am still the champion. Yeah, so, do you have any idea, like, about extra matches or like any other matches like next Saturday or next Saturday after that or do you have any idea of like what you're going to do or what type of matches are going to be or something? Um, well, not really for sure right now. Um, I might have like a normal match with you or Keith or something. Yeah. And, I don't know, we'll do something like that. Yeah. I'm not really, haven't really planned on it, you know. All right. Um. That's still seven days from now. Yeah. So I have a question for maybe the fans that watch us. Maybe they can, uh, like, comment something on this video, like uh, suggestions of what type of matches we might have or who they can face. They, you saw most of the wrestlers that we have. Hey, why are you uh, talking to me? I'm going to get Austin. You can ask him. Like, hey. All right. And, yeah, guys, anyways, like I was saying, you guys seen most of the wrestlers. Uh, Keith, which he don't really have a name yet. Uh, me, Mop Eye. Or Justin, Gribby, or Aaron, B Step, or Austin. Uh, those are like the main wrestlers that we have right now. But there's also maybe Josh, he's meant to be in a wrestling gig thing. And so is a guy named Darian, I believe. We, our music guy wasn't really here tonight. Like he was meant to be, but I don't know if he knew that we're having it tonight. I don't know if he's actually going to ever show up, but he might. I think we have a cameraman now. I don't know. I'll ask Aaron if he had a, if we have a camera cam, a cameraman yet. Do we have a cameraman yet? Yeah, Bryden. Yep, Bryden. He's a. And I guess for now, the person that's not in the match will just do the, um, be the referee, and hopefully we can get a hold of Josh, Timmy. I forgot about Timmy earlier, but yeah, we have Timmy, maybe Darian. There's another couple <laughs> people that said that they would want to join, and stuff. So we just keep going on with the week. Take it. Day by day. All right, here's B Step or Austin. All right, so we have a couple questions. How does it feel after the loss after you run in your mouth saying you're going to lose that championship? I'm going to win it. How does it feel to lose? You know, people get cocky in uh, times of uh, when they need it. Yeah. In times when they feel that they need confidence. So, uh, I felt confident enough to say that I was going to win it, but, you know, I respect that Aaron won it. Yeah. Was he a tougher opponent than you figured? Yes, he is. He was, you mean? Yeah, he was. Um, he probably still is as tough as he is. <laughs> as he was. Yeah, <laughs> yeah good point. Um, did you have fun watching mine and Keith's, Keith's match? You know, actually, I'm going to hear Keith see how he feels about the match. All right. I think, yeah. he's giving, I think he's giving us a It's a pretty funny experience. Keith, you in there? But I don't know how you uh, managed to succeed in beating him when he had your ass kicked. 
Yeah, he was. He was sorry, beating sorry, me sorry, hard, wasn't he? Here's Keith, this man himself. All right, hey Keith, how does it feel that like you lost our match? Feels like crap after I just kicked your butt and then, like, you barely beat me with an armbar. I know that armbar is tough. A tough situation. You can't get out of that move, really. I mean, I I did, but I've actually trained, you know, to get out of arm bars. Like, I've had MMA teachers, and actually, I, I'm not even kidding about that. I really have had in, MMA teachers with arm bars and crap. Um. Uh, here's Aaron, guys. I don't know. So, Justin, how do you feel after your big win? Oh, well, your little, little win. win. <laughs> it was... I mean, he was beating the living heck out of me, and uh, it was kind of tough to get out of that slump because I wasn't really feeling tonight. I had been staying up too much, haven't really had enough sleep. I was angry at the time, kind of just different emotions messing with me, but I was like, all right, it's time to get out of the slump. It's time to quit letting him beat the living heck out of me. So I was like, I was kind of like John Cena, I liked his motto, never give up. So I just kept pushing and kept pushing, and then eventually it paid off in the end. I Got to do my finisher to him, and I got in my submission. You know, man, I can't do an armbar really well. It's hard to get out of those. So, I'm pretty good at armbar as well. I mean, it felt pretty good to win, though. I mean, with me winning this early in the match, people think I'm well-known. And they might think I'm good and things like that. So, I mean, it just gives me better opportunities in the future. So, like, now I might get a chance at the title because I beat him or something like that. Um, I don't know. Do we have any questions for the camera guy? Let's ask the camera guy any questions. I don't know. How do you feel about the matches? Do you like watching them? Do you like being close to the action? You had one of the best seats in the house? Or one of the best seats in the backyard? Yep. Did you have fun recording the video? <laughs> yes. Alright guys, well that's Bryden, Mopai, Keith, B-Step, Gribby. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And I'm getting out of here. Peace out.